Have you ever seen someone and wondered what kind of person they are? What sort of life they have? This is... Spike. Yes, this is Spike. Spike was born on his birthday, 35 years from his last, a Wednesday. Spike is a painter. By all accounts, his paintings can now sell for up to £100,000 a piece. When Spike is not painting, he plays his piano. Despite never having had any lessons, he has now composed over 21 concertos. His natural ability on the piano has been attributed to his remarkable memory for words and numbers. You can give him any date in history and he can tell you on which day it happened. The day Lord Horatio Nelson was born, 29th of September 1758. A Tuesday, 10th of May 1940, the day Winston Churchill was appointed Prime Minister. A Friday, the day John Lennon was shot, 8th of December 1980, a Monday. Spike has used this gift for another of his passions, football. He has memorised every single Premiership goalscorer from the very first one, scored by Brian Dean for Sheffield United against Manchester United at Bramall Lane on the 15th of August 1992, a Saturday. Sheffield United won 2 1. Spike has always found being sociable very difficult and is therefore unable to show allegiance to any one team. Despite this fact, he still manages to travel to all the Premiership football grounds from St Mary's in Southampton to Anfield in Liverpool via Highbury in North London. Spike's favourite colour is blue. Spike lives an isolated life with his cat and news, Whiskers. He has been on his own since his mother left home when he was very young. He wishes he could remember more about his mother. They said she had gone to a better place, but on all his travels, he still had not found this better place. As a result, Spike has never been part of a family, although he's often dreamt of one day having a family of his own. Sadly, whilst working in a shop unwrapping clothes from their plastic coverings eight years ago, the build-up of static in Spike's fingertips had left him sterile. I'm told a family is now out of the question. Spike now contents himself with his painting, his piano and whiskers. Spike feels that with each setting sun, he is one step closer to finding that better place. And when he does, his mother will be there to meet him. At the end of the day, Spike likes to draw the curtains before putting on his pyjamas. After all his concertos have been played and paintings sold, Spike is no different from you or I. All he longs for is someone who will love him for who he is. Have you ever seen someone and wondered what kind of person they are.